Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into an amazing innovation in agriculture that's coming straight out of China. Imagine growing rice in one of the driest deserts sounds impossible, right? Well, China has made it possible. Chinese researchers have developed a groundbreaking method to grow rice in desert areas. Stay with us till the end to learn all about China's $100 million rice farm project in the desert. China, a country with 3.5 million square miles of land, but only 12% arable, faces a significant challenge in finding fertile land for agriculture. Researchers at Chongqing Jiao Tong University have come up with a unique solution. In 2016, they discovered a special paste made from plant cellulose that helps desert sand hold water, minerals, air, microorganisms, and nutrients essential for plant growth. They tested this paste on a 1.6 hectare sandy patch in the Yulinba Desert, part of the Mongolian Autonomous Region. The once barren land was transformed into a productive farm growing tomatoes, rice, melons, sunflowers, and corn. China is keen on expanding rice farming to its deserts, like the Alsha Desert in Inner Mongolia. The government has launched programs to combat desertification and make the land usable. These programs include innovative techniques like water-efficient irrigation and drought-resistant rice varieties. China's efforts in desert rice farming are part of its goal to achieve food self-sufficiency while addressing environmental issues. The success of these efforts depends on various factors like climate, water availability, and specific farming techniques. A major factor driving this agricultural revolution is precision farming. Chinese tech companies are developing advanced systems using AI, IoT drones, and big data analytics to optimize farming practices. These technologies help farmers monitor soil quality, moisture levels, and crop health, enabling them to make data-driven decisions to maximize yields and reduce waste. In Inner Mongolia's Yulanbu Desert, the local government is experimenting with 346.7 hectares of upland rice. This initiative aims to produce high-quality rice, prevent sandstorms, and stabilize the sand, bringing environmental, economic, and social benefits. The region was chosen for its favorable conditions, like abundant sunshine and large temperature fluctuations. Dry rice farming also offers economic advantages. According to Peng Guowei, one new, a Chinese unit of area, of dry rice can earn farmers over 1,200 yuan, $172. The dry rice stocks are nutritious enough to support livestock, providing additional income. Dry rice trials are happening across 16 Chinese provinces, including 1,000 hectares in Inner Mongolia and 100 hectares in Xinjiang. Peng hopes that once approved by the government, this technology can help other countries facing food shortages and water scarcity. That's all for today's topic. Stay tuned for more exciting updates, and we'll see you in the next video.